Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play The Raven, Legacy of a Master Thief. When last we left off, we had just had the Raven make an effort to go get the final Eye of the Sphinx. And we should examine the coffee machine, because Constable Zelna would like a coffee. Hmm. Maybe someone stirred something into the coffee and poisoned him with it. But the bump on the back of his head would indicate otherwise. Yeah, probably indicate he's been hit on the back of the I head. I think he's okay. After we've checked the treasure chamber, we should call an ambulance. Good plan. There must be other things nearby. Hmm. Look at Constable Oliver. Probably doesn't trust us at all. Constable Oliver can't honestly think that I'm the Raven. He must realize that I never had a chance to set a bomb. Although he may think that I could be an accomplice. As could he. That's also true. Let's obviously try and call for help. But after looking at Constable Oliver again. I'll grin and bear it. As long as he's nearby, he can't cause any trouble. And if I have to get rid of him, I'm sure something will occur to me. You're just saying that within earshot of him, Zelna. He will hear you. Of course, the phone isn't going to work, but we can try. Dead. No shock there. We can't call for help. The line's dead. Does the alarm system call the police automatically? If not, or if it was also disconnected, I'm not sure that anyone out there knows what's happening inside the museum. I guess no one heard the explosion from outside. The treasure chamber doesn't have any windows. And the metal gates that came down could just be part of a test. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think anybody else actually heard it at all. At all. Hmm. Oh, there's a bowl we can examine. That could be handy. Hmm. Various bits and bobs for the office routine. Looks like even the guards can't avoid mountains of paperwork. Nothing of any particular interest, though? Nope. We can't call for help. If I... Nope. No item there. I suppose you should open the metal case, then. Ah, we have the key. Locked. We have the key. Examine the control box. Hmm. Blueprints for the museum. Every gate seems to be controlled by its own switch. This should be the gate for the treasure chamber. Hmm. That's it. It's not working, is it? Hmm. There's nothing more I can do here. Okay. Well, let's head out then. We've achieved all we can here, Zelna. Where do you think you're going? I'm searching for a way into the treasure chamber, which is exactly what you should be doing. True. Also, he just drew his gun on us at that point. I'll give you five minutes, then we'll follow my plan. Open the main entrance and call for backup. Let's hope for both our sakes that I find a way into the treasure chamber before then. I don't want to be responsible for the escape of the Raven. Well, let's examine the metal gate. Uh, That's uh, not gonna work, Zelma. If you would be so kind. That's not gonna... Uh. It's not gonna work at all, Zelna. No. Uh, uh, no. That won't work. No I shock I could have told there. you that. Well, it was worth a try. Let's talk to the director. Maybe he'll be able to uh, provide us with some intel now. Director Mokhtar, I can't open the gate. Is there another way into the treasure chamber? Doubtful. No. Only one way. Only one. Hmm. The director won't help me. Whether I want to or not, I have to stick with the constable. The director... Hmm. We need something to... Ooh, we could use the lance. Hmm. The lances look sturdy, but they also seem to be firmly connected to the figures. Maybe I can break them off. On the other hand, there's been enough destruction today. 
I think I do know of something that could help. What about this flagpole? This flagpole might be sufficient to gain some leverage to open the uh, metal gate just a little. We only need just a little room. That might help. It might. We have a pole! Is it going to work, Constable? Though? He's never too pleased to walk up, it so it would seem. It's... It's moving. Uh... No. Uh, no. Not quite there yet. Ah. What if we get him to help us? Use pole with... We were almost able to open the gate with a lever, but not all the way. Hmm. We're gonna need something else, aren't we? We're gonna need something a little more... well... able to do something. Oh no way, I've got an idea. We have the uh, we have the uh we're just holding the pole. We have the um Oh well, now we've well, now we've let go of the pole. We have this here. Remember there was a sort of pulley system there. We can now open this. Locked. With the key we have. And get that pole. It fits. This pole looks far more sturdy. Ah, oh, this one looks much better. Just coming in with progressively larger poles. There we go. <laughs> um, those animations played in the wrong order. Let's try again. All right. It has to work. Constable Oliver, could you lend me a hand? Of course he will. We've got it this time. We have two poles. On three. One, two, three! Yes! Director Mokta, hurry! Put something under the gate! Huh? Director! Yeah, that, that bin there. That'll do. Excellent. We can actually get in now. Kind of. No luck. It won't open any further. Put it down, quick! There we go. That'll, uh, that'll hold it. Not for long. I wouldn't bet on it. We should hurry. And inform Inspector Legrand. No. First, I'll get an overview of the situation. <laughs> you don't think I'm going to leave you all alone with a jewel, do you? I doubt that the jewel is still in the treasure chamber. But how? I'll be watching you. Then you'll have to come with me. Yeah, he will. If you haven't heard anything from me in five minutes, me, not Constable Zellner, then open the entrance and call for help. Understood? Okay. Hmm. That bin is not going to hold at all. They're using a small metal bin to keep that open. It's not going to work. What's the destruction like? Bad. Very bad. Whoa. Whoa, indeed. Yep. There's some destruction. Let's hope that at least some of the artifacts withstood the explosion. Yeah. Why didn't he just drive through the wall with a tank? Reckless ignoramus. <laughs> that would have been interesting. The raven atop a tank steals the jewel. Sarcophagus is okay. Fortunately, the ceiling is quite high, and the gate was still ajar. Otherwise, nothing in this room would have survived the shockwave. It will take a long time to clean and restore everything, and some things are surely lost. Forever. Hmm, that's just sad. There is a hole. Not surprisingly, it's right there. Hmm. Hmm. 
You don't want to go down there, do you? That's how the eye left the treasure chamber. Oh, no. Uh-uh. No way. We've seen enough. The raven is gone. We need to get Legrand. No. Not going to happen. Squish. Great. You happy now? You could say that. Will you give me some light? He's not happy at all. Oh, not in the least. Let's talk to Oliver. He's just gonna whinge otherwise. What do you think about this? Oh, it's a right mess. You can say that again. Would you give me your flashlight? He won't. You can't seriously expect me to say yes? No, not really. So at least give me a bit of light. This explosion was much more intense than the one in London, wasn't it? You can say that again. Imagine what would have happened if the bomb had gone off tonight. He didn't risk it. We must have made him nervous. <laughs> he couldn't have chosen a better time. Legrand isn't here. There are only a couple of guards and almost no witnesses. Still, I would have thought he'd wait. Remember the train? Our opponent has a penchant for drama. He's vain and wants as much publicity as possible. Uh, even vain people don't want to go to jail. True enough. Mm, it's true. It seems like the question of backup has been settled. We can't open the door from the inside. The director will surely contact Legrand. He'll be outside the door with a full squad in no time. I wouldn't bet on it. The thief was in the guard room and knocked out the guard. What was he up to there? He didn't disable the alarm. Maybe the phone lines. Someone will notice the metal shutters on the windows. Sooner or later, sure. Until they do, we have time to solve the case. Yep. Okay then. So what do we do now? What we do now is we examine these cords. The remains of the cordon. Mm, not very good. Not much use to us now. Give me some light. Excellent. There we mm. go. Not very useful. There is this piece of cord, though. Maybe we can tie them together and make a rope. Maybe. Hmm. Use cord with... Ah! We can connect them together. The clasps aren't really made for heavy weights, but I think they're strong enough. Yep. Improvised rope. Not the best rope in the world, but it will have to do. Because we're heading down there. We're heading down there. I let myself down into the hole with the rope. You can't be serious. He can. This isn't a matter for discussion. I'm going down there. You can join me or stay here. But you, you don't know what or who is down there. Nope. That's why I want to go down there. Besides, maybe I'll find an escape route for us. Oh, all right then. Should, uh, should I hold the rope? Yeah, I think we should trust Constable Oliver. I, uh, yes. Thanks. He's just trying to do his job, is Oliver. He's just trying to do his job. Thanks, Oliver. See, he's not gonna let us fall and die. I hope not, anyway. See? Fine. I'm down. What is in here? Give me some light, Robert. Thank you. What is down here? Oh, he's going to follow us with the torch. I hope, anyway. Hmm. There's a map. Shine the light on the wall, Robert. Hey. Mm, a map of Cairo. It's covered with hundreds of small holes, and there are some pins on the floor. There's a date in the corner. 1940. Hmm. Interesting. I'm going to examine the display case now. Not a surprise, it's broken. As I expected. Empty? Yes. The display case didn't survive the fall. The thief just had to pluck the jewel out. No shock there. None. 
Actually, I thought the display case would survive the fall more or less unscathed. And three of the four windows did survive. Hmm. That is odd. Three of the four windows survive. What about the desk? What's on the desk? Shine the light over there, please. What's on the desk? Interesting. Documents, maps, letters. All of them at least 20, 30 years old. Hmm. I wonder how the Raven knew about the secret basement. Bribery? He must have done some research and then paid someone for the missing information. It's, it's a thing. Ooh. There is something over here. There's a, there's a hatch. There's, and there's a wall. Let's look at the wall, shall we? Can he actually reach the torch over there? Unlikely. There are cracks in the wall and scarf marks on the floor. A secret door? And probably the Raven's escape route. He'll think he's gone. Can you open it? Not without light. There are several panels and a kind of a handle. But I can't turn or pull or push it. Great. Something's written here, but it's too dark. Hurry down with the light. No, the raven is trapped. We should call the ground. Oh dear. He's not going to help us, is he? No, no, he is not. He's not going to help us at all. Hmm, I'm going to have to think about this. Let's talk about, let's, let's think about the correct way of doing this. Do you think this door leads to a dead end? With every minute we hesitate, the raven's trail is getting colder. But, uh, we should take it one step at a time. We're alone, and the raven is dangerous. Hmm, but Legrand would act now. What would Nicholas Legrand do in this situation? Would he wait for backup and twiddle his thumbs, or would he act? Oh, blast. Yep. Yeah, we're using the fact that he really looks up to Inspector Legrand against him. Let's not rely on the backup. We should do this now. We can't rely on the others, Robert. You and I, we'll catch the Raven. Oh, I might have believed you once. He's too smart for us, Zelna. He's better than us. You have to accept that. Should we just give up? Come on, Robert. You can't be serious. Okay, here's what we do. I'll hand you the lamp, and you open the door. Then we guard the door and wait for backup. I couldn't have put it better myself. Good plan. All right. Catch! But hurry, I don't want to think about the fact that I'm standing here in the dark, surrounded by mummies. <laughs> Great. We have the torch. Nice. That's better. Wonderful. Wonderful. Now we have a light. And now we can have a look at this hatch here. Wonder what's here. What's that? Hey, don't go too far away. Come down and stop me. Interesting. Some kind of wooden hatch. There are two hinges on this side. There's a kind of metal hook holding the hatch closed. I wonder where this goes. Let's see. I'm the talking statue. I really like to teach bad words to the little boys. At least that riddle is solved now. Peepholes. And I suspect, yes. A door. Yep. A door. Mm. The raven couldn't have gone this way. We'd have seen him, and he couldn't have closed the bolt from outside. I'm positive he escaped through the other secret door. Indeed. Why is it suddenly so bright down there? I found the light switch. You liar. When we come back, folks, we shall go to the Great Hall. And maybe we'll talk to the director. Mysteriously. He'll want to know how we managed to get out. But until then, I'll catch you later. See you then. Later.